Hey everybody, this is Modern Refugee. Uh, it is the morning of uh, May 9th, and uh, I don't know if a lot of people are aware of uh, what took place yesterday, but there were multiple CMEs and solar flares on the sun. Now, I've been following space weather for a long time, basically because I like watching aur auroras, and auroras are really hard to predict, and uh, whenever there's a chance that there's an aurora, I always peak, uh, peak my interest because... I love watching uh, the Northern Lights, and I've seen some really cool uh, displays over the years, but they're really, really rare. We don't actually live in a spot that's good. Usually if there is an aurora or something, you know, it's cloudy. But the other thing, kind of the negative thing with CMEs and uh, solar flares is, is they have the ability to mess with technology. And there has been multiple times over the years when I have noticed when there was a CME or a geomagnetic storm or solar flare, where there was technological disruptions, whether it was um, small localized power outages, there were uh, technological disruptions in the major networks, stuff like cell phones, that kind of stuff, internet networks. There's been other times when I've noticed there was uh, CMEs where debit cards didn't work. So it's uh, something that preppers need to keep an eye on, in my opinion, because there is the uh, possibility that... Um, these solar disruptions can disrupt our day-to-day -day life. And, uh, you know, we know how that goes from, uh, you know, things that have taken place here in the last few years. But I know not everybody follows uh, space weather and stuff like I do. Not everybody talks about CMEs and kind of how they can affect our grid and our different, uh, different technological services that we depend on. Now, today, I'm just going about uh, my day as normal. We already had some stuff planned that we're going to go do. We were going to do some little grocery shop and pick up a few things, um, just average day-to-day -day stuff. But I am going to pay attention over the weekend. That's when these things are predicted to um, hit. And there's always sort of a, they're never like uh set in stone when this stuff is going to hit. It's going to be, it's more like a, a couple of days leeway one way or another. But I'm going to do the normal things, you know, make sure that uh, our gas tanks are full, go ahead and pay a few bills, make sure that stuff's all caught up. So uh, anything that uh, that I would need to do that re would require some type of technology, I'm just going to try to make sure that I got all that stuff wrapped up by probably tomorrow afternoon sometime. But anyway, I just wanted to mention this, um, that if you weren't aware that uh, the things that happen out on uh, the sun can affect us right here in a, in a pretty negative way if the if the circumstances um, all kind of align. But anyway, this is Modern Refugee. Just wanted to let you guys uh, know that stuff. Um, appreciate all my subscribers out there. Hope you guys got a little something out of my video as always. And you guys have a good one.